Here's how I created Retro CRT Monitor in the GoBoard scene from one of my recent edits. All in After Effects. If you're using recent versions of After Effects, you can just drag and drop a default animation preset called VHS Flicker from the Effects and Presets panel. Yeah, that's it. But if you want to understand the philosophy behind how this effect is made, or you're using an older version of After Effects, here's a quick rundown on how to recreate it manually. Open up a comp with a text layer and a solid layer, then create an adjustment layer. First, add a Fastbox Blur to the adjustment layer. Any amount under one is fine. Then add Wave Warp. Follow the height and width values I've adjusted and set the direction to 180, downward. Add an Unsharp Mask effect to give it a bit of retro Christmas. The more you increase the amount, the crisper it looks. Apply Channel Blur, then duplicate the layer twice. Blur red on one, green on another, and blue on the third for a subtle CRT-style blur. Add Venetian blinds, then tweak the transition completion and direction to create those glitchy scan lines you see on old screens. Add a glow effect and set the radius to 20. Then duplicate the glow effect and set the second one's radius to 150. For any photos you want to put on the screen, you can just make them black and white, posterize them, and add a tint effect. Then change the matte black 2 color to whatever you want. Once you're done with your text animation, just place the adjustment layer on top. And voila, done! For the GoBoard scene, I referenced it from part of the TV series Counterpart's title sequence. Start by creating a circle shape layer, add two more for shading, and alpha matte them. Use a grunge image as the board base, then make a grid with a solid layer slightly larger than the comp. Then rearrange the Go pieces every few frames to create movement and sequence it all together. Add your text and animate the camera movement and we are good to go. Before the video ends, I want to thank you all for watching this breakdown. To celebrate 20,000 followers, I'm going to share the secret of mastering After Effects in just a couple of weeks. The first step is that you...